Hi everyone, this is lesson 7.3, Applications of the Dot Product. The dot products have many applications in mathematics and science. Supposedly finding the work done, determining the angle between two vectors, and finding the projection of the vector onto another. Let's go straight into example 1. Determine the angle between the vector in each pair. Vector A of 5 and 1 and vector B of negative 3 and 8. Recall the definition of the dot product. We had A dot B is equal to the magnitude of A times the magnitude of B times cosine theta. When we rearrange it in terms of cosine theta, we will get a dot b over the magnitude of a times the magnitude of b. I've already mentioned this formula in previous lectures, however, I have not mentioned how to find the dot product of a dot b. To find the dot product is very easy. All you have to do is multiply the first two terms of each vector, that would be 5 and negative 3 in this case, and plus that, uh, add it to the multiplication of second term, so that would be 1 times 8, like so. 5 times negative 3 plus 1 times 8. To find the magnitude, we have to use the Pythagorean theorem. The magnitude of A will be 5 squared plus 1 squared under square root sign, and the magnitude of B will be negative 3 squared plus 8 squared under square root sign. When we type that into the calculator, we will get the angle is equal to 99.246. Therefore, the angle between vector A and vector B is approximately 99.2 degrees. Now let's take a look at vector projection. You can think of a vector projection like a shadow. Think of the projection of V onto U as the shadow that V cast on you. If the angle between these two vectors, which is U and V, is less than 90 degrees, then the projection of V on you, or as short term it is written this way, is the vector component of V in the direction of U. If the angle between these two vectors are in between 90 to 180 degrees, the direction of the projection of V on U is opposite to the direction of V. In the last case, if V is perpendicular to U, then V casts no shadow. So the angle between these two vectors, V and U, is exactly 90 degrees. And the projection of V on U will be equal to zero. And that's the end of this lecture. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to check out the activity video as well as your assignment and upload them to the free teacher to mark. And I'll see you guys next time.